NBA fans, welcome back to my channel, Jordan vs. LeBron. Like and subscribe. If you would like to donate, the Cash App link is in the description. Now, <laughs> this whole three-point thing where they say Jordan couldn't shoot the three, Jordan wasn't good at three, when LeBron fans use that argument, a LeBron fan should never use that argument for LeBron because LeBron <laughs> was not a good three-point shooter. And do I hold it against him? No, I don't hold it against him. That's not his strength. That isn't where he excels. So that's not what he's going to do. I mean, he's been doing it lately just to, you know, keep that three-point average up. And, you know, he really can go he, – he can't go wrong right now because his career is pretty much over. He can't he can't hurt it. He can't help it. It's in stone. But when the LeBron fans use this argument – they just hear stuff. They don't really go look at the numbers and be, well, let me go look at the numbers. Le LeBron isn't a good three-point shooter, okay? The three for Jordan, it wasn't his strength because he never made it his strength. It wasn't a big thing in the NBA. Jordan had multiple strengths. He could drive to the basket, which that was like a 85%. He, he's going to hit those, uh, he, he's going to hit that, that basket. Um, he was crazy at mid range. Okay. So he's not going to try to do something that he, I'm not trying to say he couldn't excel at, but that wasn't part of his game. And he already told people he didn't want to make that part of his game because it would take away a lot of his other game. But we're going to prove right now that LeBron isn't a better three point shooter than Jordan. Okay. It, 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 the facts are right here. We can only go by the numbers. When people say stuff, you got to go back and you got to look at the NBA numbers and the stats. You got to stop saying stuff that you heard because when you just say stuff, that's easy. You don't have to really do no homework on it. it you, you really don't come with no numbers or no context or no stats. It's just saying stuff. I mean, this is like little kid stuff. <laughs> you said just because, just because. You, you ever heard somebody say just because? That, that's not explaining nothing. It's kind of like your parents, you you know, when you was young, it's, don't touch that stove. Don't touch that stove. And they never told you why you couldn't touch that stove. You couldn't touch it because it'll be hot. But if they never told you, <laughs> there's no context to it. You're going to go touch that stove and burn the shit out of your hand. And that's how these LeBron fans are. They don't want no context to anything. Okay, they just want to say stuff. This is what Nick Wright, Shannon Sharp taught them. One and nine before Pippen. Okay, what was going on in? What happened in that game? Nothing. They they don't have to explain any context. So let let's prove. Another thing is Jordan couldn't shoot the three. Well, do you at least have to try to shoot the three to be average, good at it, or something like that? It's like you know. You got different positions at your at, at your job. Okay, you might not excel at certain positions because that's not your position. But maybe it's been times where you had to go fill in at that position or do that job and you was pretty good at it. You probably wasn't as good as a person who does it because they do it all the time. But just because you don't do it all the time, that don't mean you, you can't be good at it, okay? Th this is the dumb stuff. So let's look at this. We're going to go season by season right here. And for me, when you don't even attempt two or more, at least two or more, you're not even trying. So we're going to look at from 85 all the way until 90, Jordan's attempts. Okay, 85, less than, less than one, 86, one, 87, less than one, um, 88, less than one, 89, less than one. So these three seasons is when he start winning scoring titles and <laughs> putting up big numbers too, like 37, 35, which was 87, 88. 89, 
And then you come down here to 90. All those years, my fault, let's go back up. All those years, he hit 17%, 16%, 18%, 13%, and then finally, 89 27%. All those were one attempt or less a game. That, <laughs> and the guy was winning, winning scoring titles? Wow. So when we go down here to 90, he jumps up and he attempts three per game. Boom, 37%. That's pretty decent. And like I said, anytime he attempts two or more, it looks like he's gonna be he he's gonna be decent or good. So we go to ninety one. He goes back down to less than two attempts. One point one. He's at thirty one percent. He doesn't want to shoot the three no more. He's not even trying. When they say won a game. Psh- that means he didn't even shoot none, probably for about 50 games, 40 games, 30 games. Look, so let's go to 92. We're back down to 1.3 attempt, 27%. He wasn't even trying. Let's go to 92. Um, 2.9 attempts. My fault. Um, 93. 2.9 attempts, 35 I mean, it, it, it's, it's not, you know, really good, but 35 ain't awful for a three-point shot. So we go to 95 when he came back for those couple games. Um, 1.9, 50%. That's what he shot. So we go to 96. 3.2. He shot 42%. 42%. Is that good or bad? <laughs> uh, we go to 97. 3.6 attempts. 37%. Not bad. Not great. So, And then we go to 98. <clears throat> 1.5. Uh, with the Wizards. Less than one for two seasons. So when he tried to shoot the three, he was okay. To decent, to good. Okay, (laughs) you got to at least try. And like I said, the more you shoot, the more your percentage goes up. Unless you, you just really bad, okay? Maybe like a center or something like that. But you can't tell me Michael Jordan one of the greatest shooters of all time, if he tried, he couldn't be good at shooting threes. Okay, a lot of these three-point shooters out here, they're not good at mid-range. They're not good at driving. They're only one-dimensional. It's like me saying, okay, LeBron isn't a good mid-range shooter. Well, according to his numbers, he's not. But there's seasons when he shot a high, uh, shot a lot of attempts from the mid-range. Like in Miami, I think he had one or two years in Cleveland, and he was pretty good at mid-range, but that's not his strength. So he's not going to, you know, try to win games by hitting the mid-range because that's not his strength. So we go to LeBron's seasons, all his seasons. He's like three attempts or more, and he's not shooting that good. 29 35%. 33, 31, 31, 34, 33, um, 33, 36, um, 40, 37, 35, 30, 36, um, 36, 33, 34, um, 34, 36, 35, 32, 39 for last year. Tell me... Now, if we go based on who had the highest three-point percent in the season, we go back to Michael Jordan, 42%. The highest LeBron ever had was 40%. Okay, that was that 96 season where they the, the Bulls broke the win-loss record, the greatest team of all time. So if we count the 50% that Jordan put up, 
but we won't count it because that was only like 18 games, he still shot 50%. And like I said, the years that he did shoot two attempts or more, he was shooting 38%. If we count all those years, which was, what was it? One... Two, three, I think it's four. The man shot like 38% if you, you know, figure all those years that he attempted two or more. Okay. <laughs> so, you, like I said, let me see, 40. So, LeBron never had a season where he shot a higher percentage than Jordan's higher percentage. And we we can get into the finals. This is embarrassing. If you want to get into the playoffs, Jordan just blows him away in the playoffs. I mean, Jordan excels in the playoffs. I mean, it gets ugly. And I can't wait until we get those get 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 to those videos. I mean, this what what you guys are, are talking about is is nonsense. You're making LeBron look bad. It's not making LeBron look good. He's not a good three-point shooter. Where, where did you get that from? Okay, all this proves right here. Jordan's not a good three-point shooter, but what it proves is when he actually tries two or more, he can be a good three-point shooter. But he's not going to sit out there and just chuck up threes. He wants you to really see his game. That's what he wanted. <laughs> he wanted when, when you see, if he just shot out, sat out there and shot threes, it would not be anything incredible about Michael Jordan. He wouldn't have a shoe. He would not have won fucking six championships. The same thing with all 80s and, and 90s players. It, it, Kobe, Kobe did shoot a lot of threes. I mean, but he had an all-around game too. But you're just like looking at LeBron doing two things. He's trying to be a good three-point shooter, but he's not. And he just drives to the basket. That's not an all-around player that really anybody wants to see. Any, the, the, the thing about LeBron that people want to see is because he's so big. 6'9", 250, just a freak of nature. He's kind of like a Carl Malone with handles. Except he really don't have any handles because it, it looks like he has handles. There's no defense. <laughs> I mean, there's no defense. He don't have a tight handle. He would get ripped up and down the court in the 80s and 90s by these, by, by these great players who would steal the ball. They were great defenders in the 90s. You would get ripped. So he would have to come up with a post game. So you can see by the numbers right here. And when you look at it, LeBron has averaged, looks like, 4.6 for his career and hit 1.6. I mean, Jordan average attempted 1.7 and he hit 0 0.5. What what's what's the big difference here? And Jordan shot 32%, LeBron 34%. I mean, I think this looks worse for LeBron because <laughs> look how many attempts he has. 4.6 attempts. Jordan 1.7. Where's all these scoring titles for, for LeBron if he's this better three-point shooter than Jordan? I mean, all this talk that makes you better at something, you got to show results. What, what's the result of, of Curry shooting all these threes and being a good three-point shooter? Where's all scoring titles? All these guys who can shoot all these threes, where's all the scoring titles? Because Joel Embiid just won two in a row. And he's the center. So, I mean, y'all got to stop. Th the three-point don't mean nothing. All it means is a fast-paced game. A lot of people have a job that shouldn't have a job because now they don't have no real skills of the game. They, they don't have any post-game, no um, footwork. They don't have no mid-range. It's just guys launching threes. In threes, you don't have to have a touch to, to hit a three. You're just like launching the ball. OK, <laughs> when you shoot mid range all around that arc, you got to have touch. That's why these guys don't shoot that mid range because it's a hard shot. Three point, you just pretty much just launching that ball. They don't they don't want to be paint players because you got to have footwork. You got to be incredible in the paint. 
Um, so, so you guys are just talking out your ass. And you can see by these numbers, LeBron isn't a better three-point shooter. He just takes more, okay? When Jordan took more, his averages went up, okay? <laughs> so like, subscribe, comment on the video. And we just deb debunked this. If you want to go back and look at the numbers, go look at them. But LeBron ain't a great three-point shooter. He's not better than Michael Jordan. If you want to get into the playoffs, it gets really ugly. I mean, that's where Jordan excels in the big moments. In the playoffs, the finals, he ain't going to melt down. So this ain't a big deal. 32 and 34, What? What? that's like 51% field goal percentage. And 53, that, it ain't no big deal. It ain't no big deal. But if you take more field goals, of course, it's going to make you, you're going to make make it look like you you was a better shooter. So, it's, it, 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 it's just embarrassing for the Le LeBron fans because they say a lot of stuff that they don't know what they're talking about. They don't have to do any research. They just have to talk. <laughs> I mean, I, I wish I could do that and live my life and not put it in context into nothing.